ओके वसुंधर लेट स्टार्ट योर थर्मोडायनेमिक स्नैप फॉर योर फाइनल आईपीआर इंटरव्यू एज यू मेंशन यू आर प्रोफेसर ऑफ प्लाज्मा रिसर्च इंस्टीट्यूट फॉर द पोजीशन ऑफ असिस्टेंट साइंटिस्ट आई थिंक ओके साइंटिफिक असिस्टेंट सर डिप्लोमा बेस्ड साइंटिफिक असिस्टेंट साइंटिफिक असिस्टेंट यस सर तो मेरे को बताओ कि स्पेसिफिक हीट क्या होता है वसुंधर एंड हाउ वी मेजर स्पेसिफिक हीट ऑफ अ सब्सटेंस अ स्पेसिफिक हीट इज नथिंग बट द amount of heat required to uh, raise the temperature of a unit mass sir this called specific mm-hmm. heat uh, it depends on the two circumstances pressure and volume uh, it vary for uh, gases for gases it has two values for liquids and solids it has only one value mm-hmm. uh, so how much how much is the specific heat of water 4.18 kJ per kg sir and kg which kilo. instrument which instrument we use for measuring this uh, specific heat uh specific it is measured by uh, i have no idea sir wasunder mm. can you tell me brief about the joule experiment joule experiment that is very famous experiment known as pedal wheel experiment uh, related to first law of thermodynamics yes yeah, sir uh, initially uh, joule uh, sir joule take the water mm-hmm. uh, and he started uh, giving the Uh, input as work and the temperature is rise temperature of water is rise uh, sorry sir i don't have much idea about that right acha basan sir tell tell me something from your understanding uh, what do you understand by that conservation of energy the uh, energy in universe is remains constant sir for uh, entire energy the for entire universe the energy remains constant so we can convert it from one other form to another form like from uh, w- our water heater we converting it from geysers uh, hand geysers we converting uh, the electrical energy into heat energy sir so some losses also the, uh, are there but the losses also convert uh, some uh, some form of another uh, energy sir Okay. So, sir, can you tell me the difference, some significant difference between the second law and first law of thermodynamics? You know, the second law is known as qualitative law. Why qualitative law. First. Qualitative law. And yes, sir. Yes. Differences you need to highlight. Yes, sir. Okay. First thing, uh, first law basically talks about the quantity, sir. It tells that the energy is converting from one form to another form. It uh, doesn't mention about the heat source and heat sink it just uh, tells about that the energy is totally converting to one form to another form but second law uh, specify that how much quality of energy is uh, converting and uh, we need uh, second law how how do we convert the energy from one other one form to another form and it uh, clearly mentions uh, from kelvin planck statement that the energy transfer takes place with two reservoir minimum two reservoirs we cannot uh, transfer from a uh, single reservoir and uh, according to clausius statement we can convert the energy from low form to uh, lower temperature to higher temperature uh, by means of a uh, external work input so uh, first law specifies only the yeah, yeah we can convert the energies but second law how we can, how we can convert and how much we can generate uh, how much we can convert the energy sir the, that's the main difference i i found what is pnm2 uh, uh it's a perpetual we call it as perpetual motion machine to kind of two uh, in this uh, in this only one reservoir is there sir mm-hmm. One minute, sir. This is this is the heat source, sir. Perpetual motion machine of kind two is. Uh, it says that we can generate if we generate hundred percent efficiency, we can say it as a per- perpetual motion motion machine kind two, sir. But practically, it is impossible, sir. It's not feasible mission. Sir, why actually study uh, reversible cycles? Reversible cycles are not real cycles. They are not practically possible. Yes, sir. Why actually we study reversible processes, reversible cycles? Can you give me some example of reversible processes? 
reversible process uh, means we can for uh, any practical application we start with some assumptions sir first of all we start with some assumptions there is no heat loss and the surroundings are isolated insulated like that we assume some kind of uh, assumptions from that we uh, uh, we uh, we frame some uh, equations to find the out, out results so initially we assume that uh, all uh, all conditions are reversible there is no loss of the heat or with the surroundings and we can achieve uh, in either direction of the work i mean either direction of the flow so the, uh, that's the reversible sir uh, to achieve uh, some approximate uh, the near i mean maximum output what we can achieve uh, that can be found in reversible processes ियमस Vasundar, what is critical point, and how much is a critical point for water? Critical point. Critical point is nothing but uh, there. Uh, when we when we converting the water to steam, if there is no, uh, there is a phase uh, called uh, wet uh, wet region, sir. If there is no wet region, uh, uh, the water is directly converted to steam. that is called critical point sir for water it is 221 bar sir 221 bar uh, pressure and 373.1 degree celsius temperature sir ach can you draw the pt diagram for water and can you show the sublimation curve on that and also show the triple point and critical point on that या सर ओके सर ओके सर ओके सर टेकिंग प्रेसर ऑन दाइस Can be an inclined line show constant. Yes, yeah, sir. Yes, yeah, sir. Oh, sorry, sir. Mm -hmm. yeah, okay, okay. Yes, sir. I got it. Yes, yeah, sir. This is TV curve. Sir. TV curve. This is TS flow actually. TS. Okay, sir. Okay, okay. okay Temperature sir. entropy flow. Mm -hmm. Okay, sir. I can. You know so what? This is PT curve. Actually, I asked you about PT pressure temperature flow. That's under. Yes, yeah, sir. Okay. at the temperature and uh, this is triple point sir actually uh, i forgot what what are the axes sir pt pt this is pt only okay sir okay. Mm -hmm. this is called triple point sir triple point means where uh, we can achieve the three states of matter at a time sir here there is a critical uh, here, point there is a critical point this is critical point sir and here is uh, here is the critical अच्छा विच वन इज अ सब्लिमेशन कर मैं प्रोजेक्ट सब्लिमेशन 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 क्या होता है एंड विच वन इज अ सब्लिमेशन कर ओके 
आपने पहले ठीक लिखा था वसुंधर पहले ठीक लिखा था ओके सर नो ऊपर वाला लिक्विड आएगा ओके सर चलो अभी मैं आपको फीडबैक देता हूँ ठीक है थोड़ा प्रैक्टिस करो रिमेनिंग ऑल योर डिलीवरी स्टाइल योर कॉन्फिडेंस इज लुकिंग फाइन सब्जेक्ट अंडरस्टैंडिंग इज ऑल्सो लुकिंग गुड सो ओनली यू नो टू प्रैक्टिस प्रैक्टिस फॉर दीज काइंड ऑफ क्वेश्चन ऑल्सो बाकी बाकी ठीक है वसुंदर रिमेनिंग ऑल इज फाइन ियल Ah, we we treat the IC engine as a closed system only because all different cycles which we are having for IC engine those all, all are closed cycle. Okay, sir. Okay. Motor cycle, diesel cycle, all are closed cycle now because we treat no, okay, IC sir. engine as a closed uh, system. Thank no, okay, sir. Okay. Okay, Vasantar. Okay. Good luck and best of luck for your final interview. Thank you, sir. Thank you.